Hey everybody, this is Blake and Jenna, Bowler Jack, Hello. and um, we have some news that we wanted to appear on video to deliver. Um, as of December 10th, uh, we found out that Jenna has been diagnosed with breast cancer, and um, that is a huge shock to us, obviously. Mm -hmm. Jenna is 31 years old, and um, it shocked the doctors. Yeah. Um, it's, uh, it's, it's, it's something that none of us expected to see. Uh, even, even at the beginning, they didn't think it was mm -hmm. cancerous, but it turned out to be. Um, it's uh, this this cancer is 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 going to be treated. Uh, we've heard that this is going to uh, consume most of our 2016 year. Uh, uh, there will be chemo treatments followed by a surgery, and um, we have had a week to kind of get this under our skin, and pretty much only family have known about this for the past week. Mm -hmm. uh, we wanted you to know about this because we believe in the power of prayer. Yeah. And um, we love you guys. And so we want you to know about it. We want your church to know about it. Um, let your church know about it. Put us on your prayer list. Please. We ask for your prayers. In the past week, we really only had a small handful of people praying for us. And we've already seen so many miracles He's happen. He's already answering prayer. And I'll continue with additional videos in this one to let you guys how, know how we're doing but he's answering he's answering a lot of prayers yeah. a lot of things that that would have made things a whole lot worse um god has answered them in in a, in a positive way for us uh however the cancer is uh very aggressive uh it's not contained um entirely yeah. but it's uh uh we caught it early we did and and that's good and so but there's still going to be uh, several months of chemo treatments mm -hmm. uh, followed by surgery and we we covet your prayers yes and uh we're we're doing pretty good um it was okay. a shock <laughs> it felt very fake yeah. uh for a long time and i and i we realized that this next year this next year is going to be a, a hard year yeah. and it's going to uh, uh invoke a lot of emotions i'm sure a lot of times when we're scared, a lot of times when we're angry, a lot of times where we go uh, through certain things. And feeling sick. <laughs> and feeling sick. And, um, but we're thankful that we get to walk through this with our mm -hmm. Heavenly Father. Yeah. That He's there with us. He's already prepared the way. There's already stories about how He's prepared the way, and I'm sure you'll hear more about that. And we'll, uh, throughout the time, we might make some uh, updates. And so uh, we, we ask for your prayers, and, and we might be setting up something later on that, that you guys might be able to follow, um, but we just ask for, for encouragement and prayers. Yeah. And um, now, the, many of you are probably asking, what does this mean for us uh, in our ministry? What does this mm -hmm. mean for us? Um, I have to say, we found out the day before we were leaving for our last trip of the year, mm -hmm. we had which was last weekend, and we had three concerts. It was a big weekend for us. And um, it was magical to us. We it was something, um, and we realized that concerts are good for Jenna. Yeah, they are uh, good distraction. Mm -hmm. But uh, we saw a lot of ministry happen. And a this lot of ministry. It's just a witness for you guys how much we love what we do. We love traveling and ministering through song, and we're gonna continue. We're gonna and continue. I it may not be able to make every concert depending on how I feel. But, oh, I want to continue, and we will be continuing or not changing any plans with the doctor's approval even. Yeah. They said it's good for my mind and body and soul and spirit continuing to do what we do. So we're going to continue, mm -hmm. and that's that's what we did. Uh, this came with plans. At, Jenna and I are supposed to be recording together as Blake and yeah. Jenna. That's the direction we're heading yeah. towards next month. And for a while, I thought uh, I thought that that was going to change. But we realized that uh, through even doctor's approval and through praying about that, we're going to continue. Mm -hmm. And I just want you all to know that we have thought maybe I should get leave the road. Maybe I should get a traditional job. But we realized that um, not only is the nor being normal as much as we can is good for Jenna and myself, but we realize that... Um, that for me to come home and do a traditional job, I actually would not be able to be there as much as I am for her. She sees me from sunup to sundown. Mm -hmm. And even we have a lot of office work during the week, yeah. but we can uh, rearrange our schedules to where I am able to go to almost every single appointment with her and take care of her when she's feeling 
when she's feeling sick. His turn. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, her, my turn. So, uh, so that's what we're going to do. Mm -hmm. And, um, we appreciate your encouragement on that and your prayers on that. Yeah. Thank you so much. One thing, my, the verse I'm clinging to Psalm 112 verse seven and eight, for he does not fear bad news because he has already settled in his heart that God will take care of him. And I believe that. One uh, specific prayer request, a lot of the ones we have asked for so far in just our family have been answered. Mm -hmm. um, one, one prayer request we have is we have heard that um, there is a 50-50 uh, chance that we might not be able to have children after this whole process is over with. Yeah. And um, that's something that we would like to be able to do. Um, but, uh, you know, it's... That God would protect my body mm -hmm. through this. And, um, and we believe that he has gone before us and he'll go with us through it and he'll pick up the pieces after it. And so we believe that and we love you and wanted to include you in this journey to be able to praise with us how God's going to use it and um, just emotionally uh, your support and prayers will need it. So thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> and Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.